Is there some sort of a Black Widow challenge going on inside my not so very challenge? Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Uh, Neve called us to hang out at the bowling cafe, which is completely fine, but Lexi got a text message, I assume from Freddy, who is saying we are working on our relationship, so thanks for helping us through it. Or is it... No, this is Sage. Hang on a minute. No, it was Demario, wasn't it? It's not Freddy for sure, so... What? Oh, we, we asked him to fix his relationship with... What's her name? The girl who... I had babies with our, one of our relatives. I can't remember the boy's name right now. Anyway, we are out here and uh, I have no idea why she wanted us here. But I'm gonna order food for date here and we are gonna have a... Let, let's have some uh, chocolate because that always makes me feel a little better. I know your life is terrible right now because you have to hang out with your family. Oh my god. She is so done with life. It's amazing, honestly. So, do you want to invite to bow reframe bell again with Neve? Is that how it works now? Oh. I miss you, Ma. You're hungry. You you want food? Well, why won't we get food? Got here. You can go and get food when we go inside. You know how to, right? This is so busy. Oh goodness. Like so super busy. I don't think you can even order anything because yeah, too busy to take any orders. Wow. Talk about the cloudy weather while we at it. He is so, so mad. It's unbelievable. Can anyone order now? Yes. Okay. So you could go and order food now, Ma, if you wanted something. Yeah? No? You want me to steal you that scone? I would do it for you, Mom. If you want me to. Well, I would do anything for a little bit of a chocolate right now. I hope my husband brings me chocolate when he comes home. Oh, actually, no. He's probably gonna bring me licorice because he's a good husband and not just a decent husband. <laughs> I love licorice. So, um... Let's have a deep personal conversation. I don't know if you should be here, Rafael Ramirez, because if I remember right, we, you stole my drink or something one time. Maybe discuss some interests with mom as well. You can probably go and wash your hands a couple of dozen times because you feel a little dirty and just go and bowl by yourself maybe. Go and have some fun then you're not surrounded by your family because you're playing and they're not. Because Lexi, Lexi would really like to have a conversation with mom but I kind of hoped that our New boyfriend would have shown up, but he didn't. Maybe... Can we invite him to come over? To Mario? You want to come and hang out on this lot? Maybe. What were you doing? No idea. Yeah, just popping by! I'm meeting with my dead mother and my sister is having a mood swing at the bowling cafe. Do you want to come over? Yay! <laughs> this music though. Oh boy. Try to keep an eye on the door now so I can see if he is actually coming over or not. Sit together. What were you ordering? No idea. You don't need to do any of that because you are just being upset, so you can do whatever you want, honey. I was hoping you would talk with my mom, but uh, my mom is very, very hungry, so she wants to have something to eat. Start to... no, let's talk about the rain, because rain is always 
for some reason in the movies very very romantic thing and in real life you just get very very shivery and cold and annoyed when you get wet so you know i don't mind rain don't get me wrong i don't mind rain but it's not the most romantic weather to be honest here yeah. what you doing love you you want to ask for advice from your sister yeah, good luck with that. They're gonna have in a conversation right now. Oh, Kachi. Fair night at the bar tonight. Do you want to go and hang out? <gasps> Should we have a sage episode? We have been so focused on Lexi right now, the last few episodes, that it would be perfect, wouldn't it? Yes. Let's go have a bear night. Do we need to have a bear costume? So this is where all the bears are hanging out. Is that right? Let's start a little bit of a discussion here. She is so beautiful. I can't get over it. So beautiful. Uh, she's clumsy. Well, that's quite fitting, isn't it? I think, were you clumsy? I don't even remember anymore. What are you? <laughs> where do I see this? I do not know where to see her. There you go. Oh, no, no, no. It was everything but. It didn't. Got to face. Right, 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 right. Hey, you don't need to be very tense anymore. You're not around your family, are you? And here's the teddy bears. Everyone are adults and young adults and elders and... I would have wanted to have few teens here, and there's a bear running behind us, and there's a mixologist just spawning behind us as well, which is always great. I mean, I'm not gonna complain. What is this lot? Oh, right. Okay, okay. I was like, uh, very, very confused right now. Also, a cat is playing on top of her box, so if you hear that noise, it's that let's go and order some food let's have some pretzels because apparently we are still hungry and i do not know why and part of our group came up here to play so we can play i really hope there would have been teenagers i do not even know if you know any teenagers do you well i hit my knee on the table i'm so sorry that it you heard that noise. He hurt me too. Okay, let's see. Let's. <laughs> Adult. Any teenagers? Young adult. Well, they're family, so they're not helpful. I want to see if there's any. Oh, R R Raylan. Raylan. Sher Sheridan? Raylan Sheridan. Do you want to come over? Do you want to invite uh, Raylan? Raiden over. Young adult, adult, young adult, elder, elder, young adult. I'm so sorry, honey. Your friend just kind of decided that it's okay to um, gossip about bear. I don't know if it's smart while there's two bears in between you two at the bar, but you know. Raylan is sleeping. Raylan, you're not cool. Okay, so no, who's dating? Young adult. Nubuya is adult. Uh, Seiji was adult. Ebony is young adult. Jinjay. Jinjay. Kito. Heidi. Jenna. Jenna. Let's invite Jenna. Are you sleeping too? Don't tell me you're sleeping too. Why are everybody sleeping at 12.22 at the morning? Oh, on Tuesday night. Oh my goodness sake. I thought this would be funny and everybody would be here, but there's just that's just not the case right now. But she's everywhere. She's got a chameleon, isn't she? She's like, yes, yes girl, I'm I'm, I'm all about bears and whatever you throw at me, I don't even care. Let's 
maybe compliment of her outfit. I forgot what we were doing. I had to stop recording for a second there. Um, well, then she's absolutely falling asleep on the bar. That's not probably a good idea. But Elise, Elise, let me tell you a funny story about how I tried to call a couple of my mates and they were sleeping at this hour. Could you believe it? In the middle of the school week, sleeping at one in the morning. I know, unbelievable, right? You're tired as well. Why are we? Why are we actually outside? Why, why are we here? Gossip about bear because there is a few, few bears. I'm still impressed how Haley is literally everywhere. I haven't seen her husband, Will. I think it was Will, wasn't it? Yeah, it was Will. You remember? Episode or two ago? It was Will. And she was on a date apparently with some wonder redhead man. I don't remember which one. It was Dupree or something last name, wasn't it? And he had to be the waitress for them two. And it was super awkward and kind of funny. And the night is over, so... What was that? Tremor and terror, earthquakes, strap everything down. Whoa, that was crazy. I was like, hang on a minute, what's happening to me game? I've never seen that before. Oh, that scared the living poop out of me. Okay. Can we just say thank you and goodbye bye? I don't think we can say bye bye. So do you want to just go home now? There's bears and you're very tense because of the tremor terror and everything is not going your way, so we, we can just head home. It's okay. We, nobody feels bad about it. And then we're gonna pause because you need to go to bed. And you're going to bed as well. Yes, good, great. Everybody, go to bed. What, what's wrong with you? I have no idea. He's yelling about something for sure. Okay. Why are we having lights on? Can we have outer lights? All lights? Does that work? I don't understand why the lights never go out if the cats don't sleep in the room. Like, if they're awake, then they just run around. Really weird. You need to wake up. Because you're gonna go to school in 15 minutes. Believe it or not. And do you have job or something to do today? Yes, you do. Seven hours. All right. Well, do you want to go and take a bath then? Because we have a bath up for a reason. And something's wrong with you. And again with you. They seem to be very, very upset. A lot of the time. Do you want to fill the food bowl and then maybe I think there was yeah, unload and move laundry to dryer. Even though I think our our uh, mate could do it, but I'll do it just in case because sometimes there's not trusting to our maid. And then try on tree. And then we are gonna try and see what's up with pickles. Can we praise pickles? And then maybe talk to pickles. And play with the laser, laser pointer, maybe? Could that make you feel better? You stand to feel better? No? Last presentation. Sage has, not pre uh, has to present in front of the entire class. She has some great ideas, blah blah blah. Should she go all out to make her presentation shine, or just uh, do what is asked? Uh, do the minimum. Gain. Yes. Good. 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 So, is that the problem? What? A breakfast at the dining restaurant with Shayna. Shayna is our grandma. You know what? Fine. 
Fine, let's go. Since the last few episodes we've been going out non-stop, let's not stop here, right? Let's request a table and she's out here again. Now it's Rafael Ramirez. Is her husband a waitress again? Yes, that's waitress number one. And this is a waitress number two. Okay, so there's no... There's only one waitress and one cook today. Okay. So what does that mean? Because last time there's two chefs and two waitresses. We don't need to sit here in awkward silence. We can talk with her, you know? But try to be funny. Joke about engineers. Sure. Order for the table. Donald Bear, a waiter. So, did they get rid of Will? Oh, they're just gonna bother me now. Can you come garden vegetable cups or salt and pepper shrimp cocktail? Let's take the vegetable cups for both of us. Oh, I'm... I'm you see, I'm really, really confused right now. Harrison, I'm out with Shayna. Sorry. There's two, two chefs now. But this is not Will. What did you... Is there some sort of a Black Widow challenge going on inside my not so very challenge? Because that's the only explanation I can come up with right now. Interesting. I really wish I knew why or what she's doing always out with different men. Make funny faces to her and complain about the sunny weather because when we have too much sun it's annoying, when we have rain it's too annoying, when we have snow it's annoying, you know, all the regular. And then ask about being dead, why not? We we didn't realize that because they De Mario hasn't actually called her yet to ask her to hang out. And I believe he still lives with his mom and dad. Which is completely fine, I'm not about that. It's more about the fact that you call me when Lexi is having breakfast with her grandma. Yes, she's technically a ghost and dead, but you know, this is The Sims. So I'm sorry, we need to reschedule to some other time. I See, I think it was this guy who she was out with. I mean, Haley was out last time. Maxwell Dupree. I am honestly really confused. I do not know what to say about it. It's pretty, pretty something. Okay, let's do a knock knock joke and all. We we really need to get our breakfast going. Are we getting our food anytime soon, people? I'm just gonna zoom in with the time here. Oh, is that ours? No. You two got your food faster than we did. That's not cool. But our food is here now. Okay. Normal quality food. You got poor quality food. That's a... I'm not gonna lie, that's a little awkward. Why am I lagging? Interesting. Can you just keep talking to her? I do not know about what. The, the, have a have a discussion about favorite band and then possibly deep personal conversation because that's a thing now apparently, so we just keep using that. And debate flavor profiles. So Crema, why are you without hair? Uh, mistletoe is not probably the, I do not know actually what that was. That wasn't a mistletoe, was it? You need to go to work in an hour. You're still... We need to stop this because last time she was at work, because last time she didn't go to work, she just got like, we. she went to work but then she was at the lot when we arrived home. So let's not do that again. Okay, so pay the bills. 
You have half an hour to pay the bills. Maid has visited. You need to be. That's fine. I have time for that. I'm just making sure that she's gonna go to work. And she's not gonna, you know, just... Hang around here. Oh, is she going? Oh, she went. Alright. Great. Good. Good, good. Now, every cat here is getting a little upset. Uh, Sage is a B student. And her performance has gone up from poor to average, so that's great. Do you want to... Oh, all the cats are sleeping. Never you mind. Do you want to maybe B first before you go and eat anything? Why are we lacking again? I have no idea, but we are, so... I'm amazed these are growing. Oh, uh, sick moves. It's flu season and somehow the entire dance team has managed to fall ill, all except for Lexi. Ooh. Now it's game time and Lexi has a decision to make. Go out there and dance alone or pretend to be sick also. Dance alone. Yeah, see? Lexi walks out onto the floor and starts to dance. The crowd looks on uneasily for a moment before... One brave fan runs onto the floor and starts dancing beside Lexi. Masses of fans hit the floor and the stadium burst into a giant dance party. Performance game is small. Oh, come on, that should have been a bigger game. Wow. What a master. Wow. Uh, skill level 2. Well, great, don't burn anything. Oh, you made actually excellent quality macaroni and cheese. That's good. And you're gonna eat where? At, at, yeah? You want to watch some, um, watch a movie at the same time. You, you deserve some fun because you stink. Mm. Quite literally. Don't mm, at me. Just do as I tell you. Don't look at me like that. Weirdo. Anyway, I think that's good time for me to stop here. And I believe between episodes I'm gonna go and work on Lexi's singing skill because she is a level 4, we need to max it out and I keep forgetting it. So I'm gonna try and train her up as I am very intrigued by what, what movie this is. Anyway, let's move on, let's not get me confused here. I'm gonna see you in the next episode. Bye bye guys.